very well. So, it seems that we have run out of options. And I'm not sure what I should do. I'm gonna keep this close for just a little while. I really need to go. I don't trust either of them. I don't think there is much I can do. Sta offerta non sarà valida per tanto tempo. No. I never do open borders unless I really need the gold. But this is gonna be such a huge problem. Well, it would seem that I have to select a great person again. We have missed out on all the early wonders except the Oracle, and there isn't any of them available anymore that will give us a huge advantage. The Forbidden Palace is almost impossible by the time I get it, it will be gone. The Sistine Chapel is no worse to me. Big Ben is too far off. So I will just keep going down this path. At least that'll save me some money. Five for now. It will be more later. And here, still too early for a workboat. I probably should build a monument, but I will go for the workshops first. This is fine. And let's now see if our friend is still. Someone needs to go to war with Napoleon, and I think Napoleon is the only one who might be interested in doing that. Pocatello, I you might want dead. to talk to him. Huh? He's also willing, no, but no, okay. Napoleon and Mongolia would just solve two problems instead of one. I just need to fix my happiness if that happens. See, I, I don't want to give up two luxuries, because mine six is not something I can easily solve. I can't do city-state quests. I don't have horses. I don't have salt. I don't have culture. I need to explore more, but, well, the opportunity is past. My scout is stuck, needs to go all the way back up here. City-states are disappearing quickly with Mongolia and Venice in the game. So they are no longer a good source of happiness, I think, for this playthrough. So let's see what we are going to do. They will shuffle in even closer. They won't declare war yet. Maybe next turn. But that's one more turn of upgrade I can get in. And one more turn closer to the ending of the deals that trade away my luxuries. French have moved away again, but these, they are so aggressive. Sambano. 
Perhaps I can set up a little trade. No. That's something that he is interested in. Uh, 30 turns to mercantilism. That's quite a while to go, but we should be fixing up our culture sometime in the near future with a writer's guild and an uh, artist guild. I won't slot it, but I will build it anyway for the extra points. I'm thinking I don't want to waste this game by not having them fight, but the way my economy is now, I just don't think I can afford it. So, I'll just wait yet another turn, see what their plan is, and hope that they won't attack. The problem is, of course, that if they do attack, it is gonna cost me way, way more than the two luxuries that I am spending on getting them into a fight. I have you, little barbarian. I'm in poetry now. A workshop that has very high priority. It'll add a lot of production. 19, that becomes 23 or 24 with the workshop up. And an unemployed city. I don't like that. No, you are gonna go with this style. Here, another workshop. And one more there. One turn to growing. One turn to growing and then we will be actually unhappy. So... We should risk going another turn without it. Um, I really, really think it's a bad idea. But if we can get through this turn, we will be fine. Yep. Shuffle more, shuffle, shuffle, shuffle. And now we are into the unhappiness anyway, or we will soon be. Very nice. You can actually go over there and mm, no. Mm, I'm gonna have you. I have no plan for this one. So just a farm there by the river. You can build the road. And now I really, really should fix this. Bonjour. J'écoute. Still the same price. La France t'offre cette proposition exceptionnelle. To Iron. La France t'offre cette proposition exceptionnelle. I'm willing to give open borders so we can pass through. Fight me. Bien sûr que non. Turn not enough. Nine, maybe. Bien sûr que non. Eight and Wales. La France t'offre cette proposition exceptionnelle. Thirty and two iron. T'offre cette proposition exceptionnelle. I will go sell the iron off, probably. 
Thank you, Madame Bideri. Huh? Yes, you, you look like a person who needs iron with your force spear. No armor. Yes, you can use ah, iron. Make. 318 gold. Hmm. To exports, to imports. It's unfortunate that I don't have any horses. I don't know how to fix that, but at some point I will need a horse. Probably buy it from someone. Because without horses, conquest is really difficult. Now. Bonjour. Continue. La France. Twelve per turn. Sixteen per turn. That's five hundred gold. It's a lot, but I think it's worth it. So there we go. That will fix the situation, and we no longer have to worry about getting into a war the first few turns. Sta offerta non sarà valida per tanto tempo. No research agreement. I want to slow down the game as much as possible, just like last time. So we are not gonna go that path. We are gonna vote for all the cultural abilities if possible. I agree. Oh, I I really agree, but I did all this effort to avoid a war with him. So I'm not gonna start one with you, but. By all means, be my guest. Yes, I agree. Please go kill him. He is a horror and must be destroyed. Get to it. Now... But we will fix that with the road at that one point. This is all of production, that's quite good. I can probably put some more gold going here. All the production dials are worked. Gold tiles are worked, production tiles are worked. Good. And the same here. Very well. I hope that this drought does not last too long. I must remember to fix this all later. The early game you really need to be willing to be behind. And there is our spy. Now, the production tiles of this city are a bit of a problem. I have this one, and that's basically it. So... I think I will build a lumber mill there, just so I can up it a little. You have to escape. I need that road! Next turn maybe, or the turn thereafter. I don't think they are willing to settle an extra city here. It's probably too close to my borders. Now I could buy this and go improve it. That might be an idea. I do like it, but it's 11 turns probably to fix that. And the next on the list is Picking a target to spy on. Now, we want someone with a fine size capital. Venice is the tech leader. This usually means that they use their spy defensively. But still, 
it's probably a good target. Uh, Polynesia is maybe a good target. I don't trade with them, they are distant. And they will get into conflicts with other people. So yeah, I think I will move my spy to Honolulu and see if that is going to work. So, as soon as this one is done, I will buy the gems and get to work on improving them. Or, actually, this one can do that. Mm. Yes, yes. Uh, I don't know. For now, it's fine. I might be able to sell him something. Um, you can go there. You can actually heal up. Now is the time for civil service and then up to education. Next turn, the uh, unhappiness will go away for just a little while. The military situation, I will have to fix it at some point, but the workshops need to be up for that. I can push out a few units quickly once they are up. Probably composite bowmen that then get upgraded. And I prefer to postpone the universities this long usually because A you need to be able to build them and B you need to have the population to benefit from them there. That's it for today, more next time and see you again.